Hi everyone, Patrick back with another movie review. Tonight's movie comes from the year 2011 and it is entitled Vile. So there's these two couples that are on this camping trip and on the way back, they're heading home. They stop at a gas station. They meet this woman who says she needs to get back to her car. She's got like a gas jug. She's run out of gas. Could they drop her off on the way? They agree to do it. And uh, when they pull up to her car, they're attacked. They wake up in this house with five or six other people. And there's this television. They're locked in, but there's this television with this video. And this creepy looking woman says, you'll notice you have these things on the back of your necks. Uh, we're trying to collect samples of uh, dopamine and adrenaline and we need that so we're gonna need you to torture each other and uh, we're we can measure how much we've collected and when you get to a hundred percent we'll let you go if you don't get to a hundred percent we're not letting you go so they start torturing each other um, and uh, turning on each other of course very, very quickly, without even really trying to make any attempt to escape from the house, which you know, I thought was a little bit odd. Um, so the whole movie is basically torture scene after torture scene, and there's not a whole lot of story or plot after that. One interesting thing, one of the characters, a guy who just, he's like, hey, there is a, there is a way if all they want to do is get these chemicals from our brains... There is a way we could do it with uh, out torturing each other. Your brain releases those chemicals during sex. And of course, one of the girls looks at him and he's a little kind of weird looking little guy. And she's disgusted. So apparently she would rather torture somebody. And she was especially ruthless until it was her turn. Uh, but she would rather torture somebody than, you know, have sex to uh, get out of the situation and uh, there was no thought to that because those same uh, chemicals would be created if you were uh, without a partner. You know, if you were self-pleasuring, those chemicals would have been created. So they could have all found little private spots and went to town on themselves. Uh, but I guess, you know, that wouldn't have been as interesting of a, a movie as the torture, I guess, to some. Or would it? Anyway, there's, like I said, there's not that much of a story to it. And some of the acting, a couple of them are pretty bad. I'll give it a pass. I'll give it a 5 out of 10. I think it's around 4.9 out of 10 on uh, IMDb. Pretty accurate.